I have got some amazing news regarding the Galaxy S24 Ultra and it is much better than the Galaxy S23 Ultra and even better than the iPhone 15 Pro Max. By this time, we know Samsung is going to launch a new processor, Exynos 2400 with the Galaxy S24 lineup, but it is almost confirmed Galaxy S24 Ultra will not feature this processor, but instead, we are going to see a Snapdragon Agent 3 only processor for Galaxy S24 Ultra, and this new processor will be an overclocked version of a normal Snapdragon Agent 3 clocked at 3.3 GHz. Also, we got a 16 gigs of RAM option in the Galaxy S24 Ultra and possibly the only model for Galaxy S24 Ultra. Interestingly, we got the first set of a Geekbench score of Snapdragon Agent 3 made for Galaxy and according to the Twitter source, the multi-core score of Galaxy S24 Ultra will be 7400. A massive update over Galaxy S23 Ultra and even better than the iPhone 15 Pro Max, as iPhone 15 Pro Max got around 7000 multi-core score. Let me explain how it is different. First, these are the initial numbers, so we can expect to get even better results from Galaxy S24 Ultra. Also, it is important to mention the new Snapdragon Agent 3 will be made of a 4 nanometer process. Some people might think it will be 3 nanometer, but it's not. And I think it is a good decision, as iPhone 15 Pro Max is struggling from a new processor and there are some heating and battery consumption issues going on with it. So the 4 nanometer processor of Galaxy S24 Ultra will be power efficient same as Galaxy S23 Ultra, so we can expect a better battery life out of the S24 Ultra. But we are going to get the same battery size as last year and same charging speed. A 5000 mAh battery on the Galaxy S24 Ultra and a same 45 watt fast charger. But S24 and S24 Plus were going to feature new batteries, 4000 mAh on S24 and 4900 mAh battery on S24 Plus, which is 100 less than the Galaxy S24 Ultra. S24 will feature a 25 watt fast charger, but Plus would feature a 45 watt. It is important to note that by getting all these new updates, the cost of making the phone is increased. So Samsung got two options, either increase the price of the phone or stick with the same price as last year, but compromise on certain things. Guess what? Samsung chose the second option. We are going to see some compromise features on Galaxy S24 Ultra. Mostly, it will be a telephoto sensor on the Galaxy S24 Ultra. Samsung will start early production of Galaxy S24 lineup a month earlier than the Galaxy S23 Ultra, which means we may see an early release of Galaxy S24 Ultra, maybe in Jan instead of Feb. If you guys want to see a compromised camera numbers of Galaxy S24 Ultra, then you should watch this video and I hope you guys are subscribed. I will see you next time. Till then, peace out.